What's going on boys and girls? We're here back at the Devil's Tree again. Hey guys, this is the moment you guys have been waiting for. So it's been about three months since we've, since we've been here. So feels a little bit weird, but at the same time, you gotta do what you gotta do to get some stuff out. We had a fun time in St. Augustine. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing and thank you for all the views and the subscribers. We gained over 100 something subscribers and it's still going. We appreciate every single one of you all. Thank you so much. Also, if you guys can, go ahead to Provoke Austin on YouTube and go ahead and check out some of our, our last five videos and our recent video. And give it a like, watch it, comment, subscribe, guys. And if you guys haven't noticed yet, go to ProvokeParanormal.com. We have an official website now where we can uh, Absolutely 100% sponsor y'all. We're looking for sponsorships. We're looking for to sponsoring people So if you guys are paranormal investigators gamers or any of that that's interested in paranormal We will 100% sponsor you. All you got to do is sign up on the website ProvokeParanormal.com. You'll also see some unseen uh, video clips and videos and paranormal investigation. You guys know what's next? The St. Augustine videos, baby C Coming up in our next video will be we'll be heading down to Tampa I hope you guys enjoy that. We got a big old surprise for you guys. So don't miss that. It's really big. And we're, I'm reuniting with somebody. He's meeting with somebody. That's right. And it's going to be one fun of a paranormal adventure. So let's get back in it here at this Devil Tree. Last time we got ran out on. And tonight we're going to stand our ground. Hopefully we don't get run out on again. Mr. John Schaefer, if you're here with us right now, please make your presence known. We're ready for this. He's ready for you. That's right. We're ready, we're gonna man. do everything we can can. Been a long time coming, man. John Schaefer, if you're with us here tonight, can you please flicker the K2 or make the cat ball go off? Mr. Schaefer, can you show us that you're here with us? I know it's been a long time coming and we're back. We're in this, oh dude, the K2 went off. Did you see that? Did it? It flickered, yeah. John Schaefer, are you playing with that K2 meter? <gasps> see what I'm saying, bro? We got a cat ball here too. <laughs> Yo, I'm hearing, I'm hearing the same noises, bro. When we started doing this, John Schaefer, I gotta, now before we get into some other stuff, I want John Schaefer to know that you can't have any ties to me and Austin. You can have absolutely no right to follow me and Austin home. I want you to know that right now, this very moment, because that is a negative, that is a no-go. Under no circumstances will you do that. And I'll say it again, too. No ties, no attachments, cannot follow me and Austin home absolutely ever. All right, sorry for that, guys. But gotta let them know sometimes. Man, K2 going. Oh, that was nuts, bro. Right on command, too, man. That was crazy. Mr. Schaefer, can you please make that go off? Cut ball, there. You know me and Austin very well, Mr. Schaefer. You don't have to hide with us. <laughs> K2 went off when he said that. Oh my god, bro. You're making the K2 go off. Can you make that cat ball go off, Mr. Schaefer? I mean, if you like messing with the K2, that's fine. Last time you made a cat ball go off, that was pretty impressive. Yeah. I bet you use your energy to put put it into that cat ball and make it flicker. Letting you guys know that we're in the woods right now, so you might hear a little bit of noises. Trees falling, old trees, branches, and all that. Could be. Could be animals and stuff like that, guys, but, but you never know. Sometimes things do happen, like last time where we heard walking and all that. That was 100%, and when we took off because it was crazy last time.
John Schaefer, please use your energy to make the K2 or the cat ball go off. Just want to see if you're here with us. If you're not, well, we'll have to make it come out. John Schaefer, make the K2 go off if you're at your house right now. If you're at your house right now, make the K2 flash. Nope. Yeah. Flash. He's in his house. So guys, his house is literally like right behind the freaking tree. We'll take you there a little bit later on an investigation. So we went there earlier just to check it out. Yeah, it's a pretty big house that he had. That's where he would live, and this is where he used to kill his people at. Yeah. Now for the now if the two young girls are here, I know it's been a while as well. If you guys want to make the I'm K2, I'm feeling coldness over here. You guys want to make the K2 or the cat ball go off? I'm feeling coldness over here, man. Feel free to do so. You come over here. Don't you feel it cold? Oh yeah, it's getting cold over here. Yeah, right over here. John Schaefer, is that you next to us? Make sure the K2 go off. Is that you? Oh. I feel like that's him. Could be him. Just gonna do a spot check really quick. Bro, quickly. it is freezing, bro. Really I don't even know. That's cold, bro. Dude, this flashlight is too freaking bright, bro. Mr. Schaefer. Oh, there's the cat ball right there if you guys couldn't see, and then there's the other one. Maybe for the victims or Mr. Schaefer, if you want to come out and play. We've got cat balls here. Oh, yep. oh, bro, I thought that was something else. It was just an animal, but you could just see it. Favorite line that everyone the likes, the cat balls. Here. But the favorite line where you got started, everyone um, loves the is, cat ball line. Is that, or no, remember when I was like, uh, John, you're a hands-on kind of guy, and, <laughs> and we're putting some cat balls out here for you to play with, John, so if you ever feel like getting touchy, go ahead and feel free to play with the cat ball. So what was then, gonna say, right? yeah, <laughs> I, I know it didn't come out right, but I, that was when I, we were just starting out. And it was kind of funny, but <laughs> see you, man. It's been a while. Come on. Don't disappoint here. You make a stick throw, a noise. Bro, it's getting cold over here, bro. You should keep trying to walk forward and see where's the coldness leading to. Are you trying to lead me somewhere, John? Make the K2 go off if you're trying to make him go somewhere. Keep in mind, it could be an animal, but it could be somebody walking over here. Back up a little bit. <laughs> the guy's fucking here. 
Hey, you get this stuff. Closer and closer to us. I swear to God, I'm not playing around. Guys, fucking hear that? I think me and Austin are gonna. You hear it one second and then it's freaking gone. Guys, there's walking literally all around us right now. Now, we don't know whether to stay or to just, you know, because you don't know who could be walking around here at night. These places are dangerous, man. This is a risk we take as investigators. You have a knife on me, so he has a knife on him. He also has mace. Alright, well the walking suddenly just dissipated out of nowhere, so... Touchdown like the end zone. When the circle turn to my home, can't get me out of my zone. Go hard. Go hard.